New for you at noon, more than 4 million people have already cast their ballots in the midterm elections here in Florida. That includes early voting, of course, as well as mail-in ballots. And the fight for Florida is a big part of the interim elections. The race is still neck and neck between Republican Ron DeSantis and Democrat Andrew Gillum. Local 10 News reporter Janine Stanwood is live right now for us in Miami. That's where Gillum will be holding a campaign stop in the next hour with President Obama. Janine. Hi, Christy, from the Ice Palace Film Studios in Miami. This is actually a building that was built in the 1920s. It's now used as a multi-purpose venue, and the purpose today is for the former president to do some big-time stumping for Democrats. I'm going to step out of the way, and you can see that uh, some VIPs have already shown up here. And, yeah, there is a line outside. There's already a line to see former President Barack Obama stump for Democrats in Miami today. Andrew Gillum is the best candidate for the state of Florida because he believes in the average people. The first camping out on the corner since 6 a.m. I can't wait till Tuesday night. We the people. Others here to hawk some shirts and spread the blue wave. And you see what this shirt, what this cap say? Make America insane again. It's crazy right now. Andrew Gillum expected here today, making eight stops from Key West to North Dade yesterday. Our next governor, your next governor, Ron DeSantis. Yeah. His Republican rival, Ron DeSantis, also stumping in South Florida, making a political pit stop at Versailles and Little Havana yesterday. I stand with the people of Cuba. Uh, I want to see an indictment of Raul Castro. Yeah. The crowd was big and the cafecito was flowing. A pick-me-up after first meeting with religious leaders in Kendall. His camp tells us he'll be in the Tampa Bay area and Collier County today. All right, so you're looking live here at the uh, view in Miami at the Ice Palace Studios. You can see that some people are already starting to come in. We do understand that this program is expected to start at 2 o'clock. We're going to see Andrew Gillum. We're expected to see Bill Nelson, who's in a very tight race for the U.S. Senate. And, of course, the former President Barack Obama is expected to be here as well. We'll be here, too, and we're going to see you in later on on Local 10 News. That's going to do it for us in Miami. I'm Janine Stanwood, Local 10 News.